And we're back with another episode. Magic only. Um, last episode, surprisingly, we were able to build two five stars and a four star. So basically, two brand new characters. Um, we chose Mona from this five star selector. And then afterwards, we started pulling from Mulani and ended up losing the 50 50 to none other than Mona. Which is actually kind of surprising because now that means we have C1 Mona. In our team which is actually pretty nice because that gives us increased damage for the reaction we can do which is awesome and as you see right here we managed to get a sucrose off banner or was it on standard we either got it from standard or we got our off banner on i think we got our off banner we somehow managed to pull a sucrose off banner which is awesome now, this episode, I would normally be like, oh, let's build them. But I'm not going to do that this episode. I, because, um, to be honest, okay, okay, let me, let me just be set up. It's been a few days since the last episode, since, well, since I last recorded Magic Only. I haven't recorded actually anything. Like, this week, I didn't even upload the bows or pull on. i just been busy, and it's been, and, and school just started again. It's like basically sort of a last year projects exam all in one go. And it's just too much headache. <sighs> you don't even know. But um, I'm just going to try my best. I have, I am in, I am like my plan currently is to start uploading these video. Well, this only challenge, not all of them, but some of these only challenges, like maybe magic or maybe bows. Not sure which ones yet. Uh, I'm gonna have to look. Uh, probably not pull on, but it's probably gonna be like bow, magic, and sword. Are probably gonna go from a weekly episode to a monthly episode, or either a monthly episode or every two months one episode. Basically, just into an update episode. Because to be honest, the only thing left to do in these in these accounts is farm artifacts, farm, and level up characters, and do the abyss. Sure, we still have some other quests, but it's quite boring to watch. Um, so mostly it's just going to be events, leveling up characters, and farming artifacts. And since I haven't had time to do stuff off game, I haven't been able to do that. Farm artifacts and blah, 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 etc, etc. I'm going to try my best to start doing that, especially when, I, if, when, I sw when I'm switching them over to a month or two months thing. I think first I'll start off in I'll start off with doing it into a one episode per month. So basically, this episode magic only will be today. The next magic only episode will be uploaded. Um, basically next month, like let's say this gets uploaded on 11 September, the other one gets uploaded on the October 11th. Uh, the 11 of October, whatever. And there's a good chance some of those, whenever that get uploaded, it might be pre-recorded. You might see a banner that is currently not available on the day it's released, actually. Who knows? Um, and basically the plan will be, the plan is going to be is I'm going to upload Tuesday. Still going to be pull on because that's kind of still behind. Um, Fridays is going to stay as Wedding Wave. And Thursdays is going to be... Claimer only instead of swords only then I'm gonna be bringing back claimer only because skinage is pretty much around the corner um, But yeah, so swords bows and Polearm will be then once a month and whenever when when that week comes around when I need to upload the bows pull bows magic and swords Then I'll probably won't upload a claim or the episode the claim or or a poll i'm that week not sure either way wedding wave will also be every friday still for now until we figure out exactly how far we would we plan to go and what we can currently do um so that will be friday thursday will be claymore and tuesday will probably pull on i think i'm gonna keep that for now a bit more longer on a weekly basis which will basically mean that Monday and Wednesday won't be any episodes, at the very least, but... Which is what I would like to say, but I am working on another only challenge for, um... Gen like Genshin, and basically I'll give you a hint. It's... I'll, I'll tell you the name of it, actually. Might as well, right? It's gonna be Nutland only. 
And basically, the the rules for that is going to be explained in the episode, but basically, its premise is about just using Nutlan only characters, Nutlan only weapons, and Nutlan only artifacts. I am not restricted by regions, though, because I want to be able to go to do all the different art quests to get more pulls. Mostly just for the pulls. And being able to level up my AR easier. So I'll just do the normal run through, but just with specific characters. I'm not allowed to use any other characters and any other weapons, so only signature weapons, or like for that specific Natlan character, or only not or Natlan weapons. So no Witset, no Favonius, no sacrificial stuff, you know. That is the plan. I'm currently trying to work on it because I'm trying to get Mulani on it. So by rerolling. And trust me, it's been going it's been rough. It's been really rough. So we'll see. Since we don't, you don't really get pulls when you reroll right now. You only get like one, like two or three pulls. So it's kind of hard to actually reroll right now. I chose a really wrong time to do this, but you know, it's all for the content. And I'm actually excited about it. I know I haven't been doing Argon quests or quests on this account, on this only challenge account because they're boring and repetitive. And I know starting a new account literally means I have to do some of this stuff. But because. The concept of it is so restricting even more than these only ones. It's kind of more interesting and more harder, I find, because you have way more limited characters and way more limited weapons, artifacts, you know? I don't know, we'll see. Um, and there's also a good chance, once we get to the point when we finish one of, one of these challenges and beat the Abyss, which is the end goal, beating the Abyss is the end goal, I, the imaginary MC either is not on the list. Maybe we'll consider it, but I doubt it. Um, yeah, once we beat the abyss, not 36 star, but just beat it. Maybe we'll 36 star it in the future if I feel like it. But once we beat the abyss, then that challenge will be over. Uh, I'll probably just send start doing updates on it whenever a new character comes out or stuff like that. Nothing more, nothing less. And then we'll have to replace it with a probably a different uh, challenge, which do it doesn't have to be Genshin. It could be a different game, a different gacha game, different whatever. But anyway, I babble on long enough. And this episode of Planet is just literally to do this event, try to finish this event. And I haven't done it on any account yet. And also to check out this one, the Dodoko Boombastic uh, Escap Escapa Escapade, I guess. I don't know. Here we go. Start the challenge. Uh, we need to. Yeah, okay. It's just normal stuff. I am gonna speed run through these because this episode just fully focusing on getting Mulani. We do have a guarantee because we did lose um, to Mona, so that is on our hand. And if with the re if we somehow get it early, then the rest of the polls is probably gonna go into the weapon banner. Just why not? Because I'm pretty sure there's not going to be any catalyst. Uh, I don't know why I'm touching those purple ones. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's not going to be any catalyst fire star until like maybe 5.3. I think. So I think we should be fine then. Alright, I've been doing some of the event parts and stuff like that. We've gone to the point where I've done almost everything. The only thing I have to do for this region is to f ignite the fruit and have... Glutonis Yumkasor Mountain King Swallow It. I'm not quite sure what that means, but we'll figure it out somehow, right? I hope. Alright, let's see. Okay, so far, so not. I've never fought this boss before, by the way, so I have no idea. Okay, I'll just do normal stuff for now. Pyroid. Oh, we need to use pyro attacks. Okay, okay, okay. That actually makes sense since they did say ignite. Um, I guess instead of Yai, we'll put um, Yanfei in for now. Since she is our only pyro character that we own. Uh, the other one is Klee, which we don't have yet. Waiting, wait, we're waiting on her rerun, basically. I made him eat it while it exploded. Before it exploded, like. I ignited it, and he ate it. 
you get a time and time because if you do it too early, then basically it explodes before he eats it. Uh, to be honest, this boss is not even that hard. 9k damage per hit is not that terrible, but it's not great either. Hey, vape, let's go. Um, actually, I don't even know why I claimed this, but I guess we have it. I have no idea why I claimed that, to be honest. That was just a pure reflexes. Um, so we got that done. Let me go claim my stuff from Catherine, and then we'll do the other region, and then we'll do the new event uh, that just came out. And we'll do some polls. Uh, I didn't want to go here. I want to cast in. Alright, some spirit way challenge. Actually, I like these. Because they're so they're quite simple. And you basically have to do nothing for them. So, they're super simple. But I don't mind that. But you just have to move around. Left and right. And then jump. You know, do that. Jump again. Jump again. And then this one you gotta jump and attack it. So you get points. Jump attack. And you attack by just you know normal attack. It's just No, of course avoid those ones. This is child's play. And too easy. And double S for the win. Oh, we got brought to the waypoint. Don't mind if I do. That actually makes it way easier. I, just, I can just grab it. This event is literally helping us with um, exploration as well a bit. And as you see right here, there is an exclusive luxury chest. And the way to get it, you have to do these stuff. Which is like basically the Sealy of this place. I forget its name though. And basically they're scattered around. Like there's one locked in the cage. There should be one somewhere close. I don't know where exactly to be honest. I forgot. I see. So you get what I mean. We'll do that some other time. We'll get those some other time. Because we're going to have to explore this whole area to get the stuff from Mulani once we get there. So we'll do that and because I think what I'm gonna do is once once we get Mulani, then I'm gonna try to record next episode before uh Kenish comes out so I can actually do the story quest. Um basically this one. So that I can get some materials for so I can get some materials for Mulani. The only way to unlock it is if we do the Anatlan Arga quest. So basically you do the whole Natalan Arga quest, you unlock the ability to do this. Then this one is its own quest series, and then after you do that, then you get these materials, which should, which is exactly enough to get you to level 60 on the character. All right, I think we finished the whole event, at least the first event, which is the trait of artist, artistry. Uh, I believe we finished everything. Uh, I'll have to double check though. Yep, we did all of that. There we go. Hello, Mulani. Uh, we did that one. We did all of these. We did that one. And we did that one. And it seems like we're missing this one. I saw it. I saw it. Oh, it was always there. Okay, no wonder I didn't notice it. All the way on that corner. Oh, that should be fine. It's just taking pictures. That shouldn't take me like two seconds. Like, I actually just watch. Gonna indwell this light here. There we go. Now we're just gonna zoom all the way there to that island. And then we take pictures of these penguins real quick. There we go. And that should be it. So we claim that one. Nice. Uh, we have 100% all of those. We have. 
all of these as well. And apparently there's an afterworld. Afterward. Please. Let's go there. Talk to her fully, officially. End the quest. And then we'll do the other one. And then we'll do some polls. Sure, we have, imagine we get a double. That'll be awesome. It would be kind of sad because I would have, I would have wished to get you know a double a keep that second one for like a new character, but or we get it early and we get an early five star on the weapon banner and we get her weapon. That would be amazing if that happens. That would be like the best say best case scenario. Get the guarantee early and then get her weapon as well early. But who am I kidding? Our luck is not that crazy. All right, we can probably only do. Okay, we can do the first two only. And I do remember this. I think we have done this on Cam on one of these accounts back then. I'm surprised it's already back. So it'll take at least a year, but never mind. I don't think we've done this. I don't think we've done this. This is literally Pac Man. Uh, I'm confused. Oh, okay. Oh, it replaced bombs down. Oh, I see. And then we do that. Yeah. So what does this leaf do? Oh, more hearts. Okay. Oh, that spawns them. Uh, that literally spawns them. Do not touch that. Defeat all the spiky stuff. Okay, okay. So let me get the heart back. We'll do this. Whee! Easy win. Okay, that was that was that was easy. But I gotta be careful with those upgrades because they can definitely hit me. Well, we did the first two, we just gotta wait for the other ones to unlock, so. Yeah, that's done now. And now we can start pulling, which is actually what we want. I bet everyone was just waiting for us to pull. Naturally. So that's why I'm trying to make that's why I'm trying to make this episode quite short, so you guys don't have to wait. To see the poles. Now, first thing first, we're just gonna transfer these to center wide fades. And secondly, we're gonna do first the first five fate points. No, fate wishes, I mean. Standard wishes, whatever you wanna call them. <clears throat> I don't say we're close to a five star, but we'll check afterwards. And nothing. And last one is also not saying. Yeah, let me double, let me check. We had a four star just recently, so we're currently at seven pity for four star. Okay, okay. Five star wise, we are at thirty-five, thirty-nine. Yeah, we're thirty-nine now. We're thirty-nine. All right, moment of truth. We are currently at. Let me see. We're currently at 35 pity for stand for like a limited banner. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, 35. It's guaranteed. And we currently have 29 pull. So 35 plus 29 is 64. Hopefully we get it with them those. I'm not sure. Let's do a temple. This will be as a 45. Okay, no five star. No five star. Um, just give me off banner four stars. Not that one. And we only got one. Okay. Well, 55. Nah, oh, man, come on. The first one is banned again. And no, okay. Gee, this is gonna be a force right here then. Yeah, there it is. And Skachina, we don't really care. Come on, please don't let me, please don't make me go all the way to pity. Come on. Really, game? Man. Yeah, we're definitely getting one more four star. Yeah, right there. And more Bennets, I guess. I don't know how many Bennets we've gotten, but we've gotten quite a few. And last pull. Nothing. Okay, this actually hurts. 
We're currently at 65 pity. We are currently at 65 pity. 65. That means we need at least 10 more poles to hopefully get Mulani. And our Bennett is C5. Which we can never use. I would have rather had that C5 Bennett on my sword only, not gonna lie. Anyway, well. So much for that summoning session. I, I kinda did speedrun it, but like. I don't like stalling stuff and. Yeah, that, that went horribly. That, that that was like basically worst case scenario. That actually made me sad. Well, we have 6 days and 23 hours left. I should be... I'll try to record one more episode. Um... Of us pulling her and then if we get her of that episode which i'm pretty sure we should be able to hopefully fingers crossed because by the time i recorded that the doko event will be fully out doko Go event so i'll be able to get primogen from there log in daily from the welkin and um, yeah that should probably help us get into the right track then we get her, we'll build her that same episode for a bit. And we do have 10 fragile, so we could probably farm some artifacts for her, I think. We'll see, we'll see. But yeah, after that episode, Magic Only will become a monthly episode. Just heads up. Actually, I was planning on doing it after this episode, but because we didn't get Mulani, I'm probably gonna do it. After the next episode, so yeah, you guys are getting in another episode. Or I'll make the suspense real and leave it off a good thing here. And then the next time you find out if I got Mulani or not, will be a month from now. Woohoo! Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I won't. Only one more you to know subscribe and like the video, and you'll find out next time. Thanks so much for watching. Doo -doo -doo.